Hey, welcome to Class Act Media. I'm Jack, and some of you might remember a while back I made a few videos where I read some old comics of mine. They were fun, got a decent number of views by the standards of my channel, and most importantly got me thinking about my old characters. I made those comics in... sometime in elementary school, I don't remember exactly when, but ever since I stopped making them I've still been thinking about those characters and developing their world. In those years, I've been formulating their personalities, their worlds, and eventually, around late 2018, I finally just said to myself, okay, time to start making these comics. Although, this time, I didn't want to start with Wonder Boy, even though I have plans for him in the future. No, this time I wanted to start with another character, who actually appeared already in a comic I read in the video, reading my terrible childhood comics The Lost Stories. The Dark Phantom. I just felt like a smaller scale hero with no superpowers was a better starting point. I actually started Dark Phantom number 1 when I was in high school, and have a fully illustrated version of it done entirely by me. However, I soon realized that I wouldn't be able to do this all by myself. I'd need an artist to work with. But finding the right one was surprisingly difficult. Well, okay, finding artists is easy. Twitter is full of ridiculously talented people. But finding one who was willing to work with me? That was tricky. Can't say I blame them. It's a pretty huge project and I was an unproven writer. How could they know if this was worth their time? After trying and failing for months to find an artist, I finally found someone on Twitter by the name of Miki the Creep. Miki's style was perfect. It had that comic booky superhero look while still being dark and noirish. I reached out to him, and thankfully he said yes. I sent him a few reference drawings for the characters, went to bed, and when I woke up I saw that he had already sent me his very first concept art for Dark Phantom. That's when I knew he was perfect. Progress on Dark Phantom number 1 was slow going, mostly because Miki was still in high school at the time and he was doing the coloring as well as the art. In future issues I've been taking care of the coloring. Finally, in January of 2020, Dark Phantom No. 1 was released on Comixology, and today I wanted to do a read-through of that first issue while throwing in my own commentary. And hey, if you like it, I'd really like it if you read the following issues. Links in the description, please read them. We worked so hard on these comics, please read them. Newland, New York, 12 years ago. Originally I had that narration box giving a specific date, but I decided to go with the more vague 12 years ago so as to not fully date this comic. It's funny how we start each day expecting it to be like every other. We go about our day, our routine, because that's all we know how to do. Rob, ready to go? Because we have no reason to believe things will happen any differently. Uh, yeah, almost. Well, hurry up, you're gonna be late. Okay, Dad, we're going now. See you boys later. But you never know what life's going to throw at you. You never know what day is going to be the worst day of your life. So, Dylan, I was thinking, you know, about the store. What's up, bro? When did you think I could start working there? Maybe this summer. Why? Because I want to help you run it someday, duh! That's never going to happen. Rob, I've seen what you can do. I know how smart you are. The whole reason I run the store is so you can afford to go to college eventually. You're capable of so much more than this, and I don't want to ever hold you back, okay? Yeah, Dill. Okay. That being said, I wouldn't mind a helping hand every now and then. How about today? I have a test that'll take any excuse to skip. No. Nice try, though. I'm pretty proud of this interaction, not to toot my own horn, but I think I did a pretty good job establishing Rob and Dylan's relationship fairly quickly. Elsewhere. You know, it's not often we stop to think about the choices we make. Say I had a bagel for breakfast today instead of an egg. Hell, my life could have ended up completely different. What's the matter, Artie? Scared? No, no, it, it, it's just that, that, that I, I've never... Cold feet, Arthur? Speed Demon? No, it's not like that. I just... Uh! <sighs> yes, every day we're making these decisions, sending our lives careening off into God knows where, and yet most of us really stop to give them a second thought. The demons want to help you, Arthur. I want to help you. I just need one favor first. Is that too much to ask? N no. No. No, sir. Good man. Take this. 
make me proud. Sometimes it's hard to tell when you're about to make the worst decision of your life. Later that day. Hey, bro. How was school? You know, the same. How'd the test go? Um... Is that a good um or a bad um? Uh... Alright, I think that answers my question. The West Side Demons ask for your... Uh, uh, cooperation. I'm sorry? J just give me the money! Whoa, okay. Let's just calm down. Shut up! Please! J just, just do it! Okay, why don't you just put the gun down? This page was originally supposed to have an onomatopoeia for the gunshot, but after spending close to an hour trying to find the perfect font and color for it, I realized that it would just be better to allow this moment to hang in silence so the reader can decide how long it lasts. <laughs> That's not... No! I... <laughs> When Dylan died, I was completely lost. He was all I had. At first, I didn't know if I could even go on without him there by my side. But I knew he wouldn't approve of that. He said it himself. He didn't want to hold me back. I worked my ass off and saved for college. It helped that Dylan had already put away some money for that purpose. He was always looking out for me. I was going to make my brother proud. Oh, hello. You must be my roommate. I'm Bartholomew Patel, uh, Bart. Hey man, Rob. Rob Lancaster. Heh. <laughs> What's funny? It's just that you're the first person to hear my name and not make a Simpsons joke. <laughs> <laughs> Bart and I clicked almost instantly. We made a hell of a team. I made the deals, he crunched the numbers. I love Bart, but he's not the most charismatic guy. We kept working our asses off long after we graduated college, and eventually, it paid off. Good news, Rob, it's official. Landcorp is now the biggest consumer goods company in Newland. Something wrong, buddy? It's not enough. Not enough? Rob, we're not trying to be Bill Gates here. This is what we've been working toward. They never caught the guy who killed him, and I let him get away. No matter how big this company gets, that won't change. I need to do something more. I knew my work wasn't done yet. At first, I didn't even know what I was trading for. I just knew I had to be ready for something, anything. I was going to make my brother proud. This is the only part of this issue I'm not in love with. I needed a reason for him to become a superhero, but I just don't think I did enough to justify it. In future issues, I did more work to try and justify his reasoning, but here it feels a little shallow. Twelve years ago. Please, please speak to me. Shut up. Shut the f*** up. I ask you to do one thing. One f***ing thing. Uh, I know. I, I'm, so, I'm sorry. I... I wanted to be your friend, Arthur. But you made me do this. Damn it. It's Morello. What the hell does he want? Arthur, right? Yes? You're coming with me. So Morello wants to meet you. My name is Arthur Wright. This was just one in a series of bad decisions that made me the most notorious criminal in Newland's history. Now. Whew. Okay, Robbie. First night on the job. Who's going to be your first happy customer? Well, that's convenient. Okay, let's go save a day. Whew. Come on. You can do this. You trained for this. Ah, uh, who am I kidding? I'm no action hero, I'm just some kid with too much free time. No. No. I stood by and did nothing when Dylan needed me. I won't do that again. Never again! You okay, sir? I, uh, yes. Thank you. I'm Gregory, by the way. Uh, Gregory Knight. I'm, uh, I'm the Dark Phantom. I think about that first night a lot. Sometimes I want to go back and tell myself about all the extraordinary people I'd meet, the incredible victories I'd win, the amazing places I'd go, and the way it would all eventually end. My name is Rob Lancaster. I am the Dark Phantom. And so, a legend is born, and a new name is added to the roster of those that make the world of fantasy the most exciting realm of all. 
He came down from the sky like an angel, but sort of demonic, I guess. He saved my life. Yes. Yes, that's it. I finally understand my purpose. Next time, the fury of Glacia. And that was Dark Phantom number one. Want to find out what happens next? Check out the rest of the series on Comixology and Gumroad. Links again are in the description. I know they cost money, and I considered using a site where people could just read them for free, but I'm currently publishing them at a loss, and I wanted to put them on a site where I could potentially, someday in the far future, maybe make a living off these things, or at least see a return on my investment. I hope you understand. And one more thing, for the rest of the month of June, 100% of all profits made from Dark Phantom sales are going to the National Police Accountability Project. You can find more info on the Dark Phantom Twitter account, at DarkPhantomCAC. And hey, thanks to all the people who contributed voices for this video. Famous YouTube funny man Laugh Twouse as Rob Lancaster slash Dark Phantom and the Morello Thug. My brother Char as Dylan Lancaster. My IRL friend Chris as Arthur Wright. The Gamer from Mars as Bart Patel. Raphael Dijon as Speed Demon. Ross McIntyre as Gregory Knight, Frank Lancaster, and that Westside Demon Thug. And Twouse's girlfriend Diane as Glacia. They all did a great job, and I appreciate all their contributions. Anyway, if you like this video, consider subscribing. If you really like me, you can check out my Patreon. If you want updates, follow me on Twitter at ClassAct underscore media, because at ClassActMedia was already taken. Links to everything are in the description. I'll see you guys later.